This is a PowerWorks podcast short with Glenn Power and me, James Pikeaway. People don't necessarily think and they'll see other cars go through and survive it. Exactly. Well, and you see some of these. That. So there's there's the second problem for everyone when we're driving through puddles and we're driving on wet stuff is everyone you, you always get the, the group of folks saying, my vehicle's all-wheel drive, I got four-wheel drive, I can do the puddles. Mm. You can, and and you you might be great for most and most of the time, but not only do you have to worry about air intake and water issues, you also have to worry about hydroplaning, and this is yeah. a wonderful word, yeah. hydroplaning, when it doesn't matter how much wheel drive you have, there is no friction between the surface of the pavement and your tire, because yeah. there's a thin film of water, and no four-wheel drive saves you when you hydroplane. No. And this also happens. I see this all the time when people go through these puddles. They're just hydroplaning. Yeah. And, oh, don't forget, when you go through the giant puddle, because you want to make that wonderful surfer's arc, no one ever has their windshield wipers going fast enough. No, so no. for a moment, you're blinded. And who knows if the guy in front of you has gone through and stalled. You also can't see what's in the road. No. You also can't see the edge of the road. Oh, no. It's terrifying. And it's very difficult sometimes to judge where the curb is, yeah. where the manhole covers are where the potholes are, yeah. if there's anything that's been washed out into the road with the rain, which invariably there has been. Yeah. And then don't forget, what is it that we see on the road after the rain and the water's drained away? Thick, thick, just sandbanks everywhere yeah. where it's washed the sand off the side of the road. Yeah, You will get stuck in that and you will slip and skid on it. Yeah, And it's um, it's just not worth the risk. No. Um, I, as, much, I, as, much, as much fun as it is, don't get me wrong, it's fun. Every, everyone loves doing it. It is it is fun. <laughs> it is it's really fun when you know as long as it's in a safe fun. You ride your car off and yeah. you get stuck. And then don't forget then at the point don't the the worst part of all of this, even if you say it's only material possession, no problem. <laughs> you've got to deal with yourself looking in the mirror every day. And yeah. then you've got to get out the car. Yeah. In the water. Uh huh. And do the walk of shame yeah. with that. He said there was a load of load of guys at the side of the road like the pick up higher guys they just got out the cars and were like taking pictures and videos of, of it course the yeah i mean <laughs> the humanity yeah oh man 